Yep. Black boys in the building. Uh huh. Yep. Yep. Uh oh. Got a demon on my shoulders, off the demon time. This is demon time. Yeah, I got a, I got a, I got a demon on my shoulder. He's always talking to me. Let me tell you, uh huh. I got a mind so designed for crime. Black boys in the building. All right, so now we're gonna take a look at the shoulder line theory. What is the shoulder line theory? That's lining your lead shoulder up with his shoulder. So if this is my opponent, instead of standing right here. I line my lead shoulder up with, this is his shoulder right here. So I line my lead shoulder up with his, so I'm already standing at an angle. So when I throw my left hook, I'm already there. When I throw that, you know, straight right, I'm leaning to the side. But I'm doing it off of his shoulder line. I'm not standing in front of him. What that does is make your opponent want to get in front of you and you make him pay during the transact transitions of him trying to get in front of you. Cause I'm standing here, so he wants me here. So we can, so he feels comfortable, but you stay at this shoulder line, bang, using your jab to split the seat. As he comes, now I kind of lean, I, I line my rear shoulder up with his rear, but I'm always off to the side. Bang, he comes with this way. I'm lined up with this shoulder. Ah, ah, he turns around, spin him around. Oh, for that rear shoulder, when I go here, I'm lining up my rear shoulder up with his, so I'm offline. So what you want to learn to do is to constantly maintain your lead shoulder with his lead shoulder or your rear shoulder with his rear shoulder, so that way you're already offline. And then you start adding in your, moving your head and ducking, you become very hard to hit. Show the line theory. Black boys in the building.